Minister for Security Jim Mohez appeared in court in the company of his wife, lawyer Moes Garukutana, for the judgment set to be delivered today. <laughs> Justices of the Court of Appeal, led by Shebrion Barishachi, Stephen Musota, and Christopher Gashirabeka, did not waste time through the registrar to read the judgment. The Lands Council is shooting in the air in an intense crossfire battle. Whether the investigation was fair or not is immaterial. The three justices upheld the decision of the lower court in Kabale, confirming Mukwez as the duly elected member of parliament for Ujumbura County. The land trial judge was therefore right in finding that the appellant did not cite any of the provisions of the law, not complied with for the petitioner to obtain a remedy under the PEA. The first respondent, Mwezi Jim remains the, valid, the validly and lawfully elected member of parliament. Mwezi's opponent, Fred Tumuhire Tudia Mwezi, filed a petition against the minister challenging his victory, citing voter bribery, ballot staffing, and voter intimidation. After the application was dismissed, each party was told to bear its own costs. The minister and his legal team welcomed the decision. The ruling is good. It's fair. Though I am a bit disappointed with the issue of costs, we have always maintained that there was no reason why our client should have been dragged to court in the High Court. And after winning in the High Court, why he should have been dragged to the Court of Appeal. The people of Rujumbra had voted me overwhelmingly, defeating my opponent in all the five sub-counties and the two town councils. In a related development, the Court of Appeal has thrown FDC's Moses Okia Atan out of Parliament. The Electoral Commission has been ordered to hold fresh elections after it was ruled that the Soroti City East constituency elections were held illegally because of boundary issues. Soroti High Court decision led by Justice Angeni had initially nullified Okia's election on grounds that it was illegal for the Electoral Commission to reconstitute the boundaries of Soroti City East constituency by removing the parishes of Alot and Opia parishes and adding them to Soroti City West. MP Atan, who was not satisfied, rushed to the Court of Appeal to challenge the outcome. Moses Okia Atani's opponent, Herbert Ariko, expressed his joy after receiving court's ruling. With some of the judicial officials in Soroti to alter the boundaries that parliament had passed. That indeed, you may deprive somebody of what they deserve, but when God comes in, when the law is followed, the record will be straight. And today, that has been corrected. Now, the issue is that when parliament created Soroti City East, OPI and Alouet had been placed in East, and so the voters were asked to go to West. That's what the court has said. Having moved those two wards out for purpose of this one election and not any other election, that was unconstitutional, that was illegal. Flavia Ninkoze for CTV, PM Edition.